car is starting to move. Things are happening. We're moving. There's no one driving. Hello car friends. Okay, so today we have got the Tesla Model S. Oh yes, it is the P90D. We're here with Carl, Ollie and myself and we're going to be testing the Tesla Model S versus the iPhone 7. Which one is going to have better battery life? Now we thought about this and actually the best way to test is to see whether this car which needs charging can get to Edinburgh. So we need rules and the most important thing here is going to be charging. This car will charge 50% in 30 minutes, but to charge for a full charge, it takes about an hour and 15 to an hour and a half. This thing, it's got its own rules. It just did what it wants. But we've got a USB charger that can only be charged when we're in an official Tesla charging station. Let's see what happens. Come on boys, let's go. Here we go. Yeah, Next stop, Edinburgh. Yeah. Next stop is Northampton. Yeah. We've got a 20 minute charge. Northampton, Warrington. Green, right? Quite the green. Yeah, I think we're in the green where they go uh, and get married when they're 16. Is that why you're yeah. taking this here? Let's go. Oh, that's music. Yeah, that's it. Is. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, There's no warning. Good. There's no warning. I'm used to hearing an engine go. <laughs> so I should explain wow. that this is the Tesla Model S P90D. Now, essentially, what that means is. Well, the 90 is the range, so it goes from the basic range, which the base range it sort of starts at around 60, um, and then it goes right up to 100. So 90 is a really high range car. It also means it comes as standard with ludicrous mode, and that is what- Which you've got turned on. I'm gonna show you, and I'm learning as I'm doing it, the control panel. It controls the whole car. So right now we're in standard ride height. Let's good. go low, boys. We go lower. Yeah, why not? We're gonna need something to eat when we get into Edinburgh, so shall we find a restaurant? There we go, oh, we, we have a choice. We've literally got TripAdvisor up, and it's showing us what are the top 10 places to eat in Edinburgh. Ollie's just mentioned he's a little bit cold, so we're just gonna uh, warm him up a little bit. Here's steering wheel. I think this car has more heat than my house. You know in the morning, the car's frosty. Yeah. yeah. You don't really want to get out, you frost it, it's just genuinely cold. You just get the app open in the morning, Press the heat to car, get everything ready for when you get into the car. So there is one cool feature I want to show you. If you click this, it sets your speed. So now, it's not, I'm taking my foot away slightly, just covering the brake, and it is set, it's much more speed. To be honest, I pop on in signal as that's an optional extra. I can raise this, click it twice. The car is driving itself. I am not, look. I can't take my hands off the wheel because of legal reasons, but it's, there's a bend coming up when you're about to see something special. Taking on the bend, it's turning slightly. It's turning. But... It's like buying an iPhone, right? You buy the initial iPhone, and it doesn't mean it stays the same. In fact, the software updates happen over the air, so you don't even need to do anything, just sit back and it'll update itself. So we're looking out now for a Tesla charging point and we're just pulled into a random hotel, which is where it thinks it is, to be fair. What is this? Yeah, there. Yeah, we... uh, ah, left. there. Left. 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 Yay! <laughs> awesome. Okay, so we've just arrived in Warrington. We've got loads of charge now, but right now we have got 241 miles of range, which means that when we arrive in Gretna Green, we only need to really charge for about 15 minutes before we make the next trip. The iPhone, 31%, so it's dying. While this is nearly back on full, this is only on 31%. A lot better idea. Put that on. <laughs> He's not kidding. You can't see from there, there's no way. <laughs> okay, so whilst Carl and Ollie think they're pranking me, I've actually got a little app on my phone which allows me to bring the car to me. So they're gonna think the car's moving, but actually it's just me. The car is starting to move. They're gonna be thinking what is going on. Oh no. What's happening? Oh, things are happening. We're moving. There's no one driving. Now they have no control over it. I'm summoning it on the app. We have a winner. 
the Tesla still going, still has many miles left. I think about 150 miles left in the tank. The iPhone, poof, nothing to celebrate. Kendall Mint Kate, because we have arrived quite safely in Kendall. We've got charged, we're off to Gretna Green. The iPhone's dead, the Kendall's needed because of the sugar. Win, win, win for Tesla. <laughs> Good work, boys. Scotland. This is correct, they're green. Okay, so who's getting married? Which one of us? This is the last charging station before we get to Edinburgh. Push a button, sighting, click. We're going to Edinburgh. <laughs> Awesome. So we made it to Edinburgh. You can see Edinburgh Airport behind us. The iPhone 7, well that died. The car made it. It made it with plenty of time, like two and a half hours extra than the iPhone. Now we're just gonna go all the way back and do it again. Awesome. We've just got back. It was so, so, so tiring. I am so tired. Uh, we've gone all the way to Edinburgh from London. In this car, it's a Tesla Model S, the P90D. It's totally awesome. And if you were wondering whether it would be the iPhone 7, it absolutely smashed it. It's gone. So go out, ditch your Apple, go and buy a Tesla. Deal done. Sleep. Okay, guys, you know the deal. Go and subscribe. If not, there's nothing that's going to happen in the next 15 seconds. So you might as well go and do it now.